Welcome all, and thank you for joining me on my first inspection of my new party paradise right here, where I'm going to propagate food. And I'm definitely gonna be working hard to propagate dandelion. I'll show you why. Looks like we've had chickens back here before, so we might have some chickens in our future. I can make this happen. Just have to fence off my garden space. So I'm gonna not really show you the home intentionally, but I do want you to see all of these fruit trees. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So many fruit trees, I honestly don't know what all they are. So. Here's the backyard from the house perspective. I've searched the entire property and only found, there's gotta be one more somewhere, but I found one lonely dandelion here. Goodness gracious, I hope nobody steps on it over the next few days. I feel like I already need to put something up to protect it. It's the only dandelion, and it's a good one. It's a good, strong, healthy dandelion with the good, prickly, toothy leaves. But that's the only one on the entire property. There's just about every other kind of wild food and weed here. See here, I've got a very good natural runoff here where I'm gonna capture water to create spaces to grow food and dandelion naturally organically right here there's another large space out front there where i'm going to turn that into the main compost space now i will probably have two back here i will probably compost i will probably garden here there's a lot of natural water i can get to run this way i can also capture water you can see here we've got a greenhouse intact it doesn't look all that but um it is a steel structure and so it is a glass greenhouse it comes with a little office space so looky there we're gonna have a little production space right here to do what we do with dandelion chef but just kind of keeping to the basics if i do have some chicken to lay eggs there's this space right here it's actually a petroleum gas line space right here but it's not part of the property but it can be i have two gates one to put here one on the other side and so then if i put my actual garden over here then i can fence that off i can garden around these trees with some raised things but uh, chickens will get in there i'll just have to think it through but here we go the dandelion chef party paradise i want to say thank you to everyone who has followed me with my dandelion videos over the years because i have made many many multiple videos that i have posted in many different formats over many years so thank you very much for coming along to this new party paradise. Look at this thing. I'll be able to catch so much water in so many spaces just right here. The one challenge is this is a big cedar. So I can't really do a whole lot right under here, but I can up to it there and then out to the road out here. You know, if nothing else, I can do some raised beds up here and uh, let the water that runs down there affect them and then over here where this poor cactus and bushes are for now i'm just going to cover this whole space with my uh, uh compost this will all be a good composting space right here and not a food compost all leaves and organic greens and sticks and 
things like that okay thank you very much for watching and you are invited along with dandelion chef to the dandelion chef party paradise where i will be making professionally edited videos on a regular basis documenting how to do everything from turn your little piece of land into a thriving dandelion land like there's no dandelion here anywhere i'm gonna have to look at this soil but one way or another through composting i will have multiple dandelion growing on this property so that alone will be worth your time to keep up with but also food i'll be able to grow enough food and with these fruits that i will be able to make some really nice quality videos so thank you to each and every one of you for your support over all of these years and let's get ready to take it to the next level and have a good time together all right we'll see you next time and all the time much love always